We just learned how the world's number one YouTube creator cracked YouTube. We just learned how the number one YouTube creator cracked YouTube. <laughs> YouTubers, <laughs> they actually get this, make more money than Netflix. And it's all because of one picture. Nick, what'd you think of my Mr. Beast impression? I think your Mr. Beast impression is getting really good. You just shout a sentence. You outdid the cookie crisp. I just want to put that out there. Well, yeah, it is Mr. Beast. We mentioned him on the pod last month. He was crowned number one by Forbes as the number one creator in the world. He had 150 million YouTube subscribers. He's making $54 million a year, and he's doing it by paying you cash to bury you alive and then filming. Paying you cash to bury you alive! <laughs> <laughs> so a lot of Yetis were wondering, uh, how did the number one creator, Mr. Beast, make $54 million in a single year? His revenue? It's mostly YouTube ads. Now, this is what we thought was interesting. Last week, Mr. Beast was interviewed by Colin and Samir, and he revealed the number one way he gets so many YouTube views. The thumbnail. The thumbnail. The thumbnail image. The thumbnail picture we've all seen. One little JPEG, one PNG file. The secret to the number one YouTube star isn't the massive amount of content. It's a picture the size of your thumb. Yetis, the thumbnail is that little image preview that every YouTube video has right next to the title. And the insight from Mr. Beast and his YouTube team is that one picture, that thumbnail, is what gets the click. And that click is what gets the view. So Mr. Beast's team creates 25 thumbnails for each video before picking the one to actually use. We repeat, the world's number one YouTube star has to pick from 25 different thumbnail options. That's how much they care about the thumbnail. He treats thumbnail selection like the Nobel Committee treats Nobel Prize winners. Because what drives your click on YouTube isn't the video's title, and it's not the video's content because he haven't seen that yet. It's the thumbnail pick. Exactly. Now, the videos have to be compelling. There's got to be good content. But they won't even get clicked without the pick. And that pick won't exist unless it's a thumbnail. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> now, Yetis, we've told you before that packaging can be the product. Well, the thumbnail is the equivalent to a video's packaging. The thumbnail is the digital packaging of a digital product. And you know why packaging is so important on YouTube? <laughs> because how many YouTube videos are created, Jack? This is one of those, wow, 3.7 million videos are uploaded every day. Sit down, stand up, and sit back down again. 3.7 million YouTube videos. Every single day. Jack, with that much competition, the first impression... Which is the thumbnail. ...is the only impression. So, Jack, what's the takeaway for our buddies in the creator economy? YouTube's code is a code worth cracking. Yetis, the other key insight that we learned beyond the thumbnail picture... It's that YouTube pays a whole lot better than you think. Those aren't our words. Those are the words of Mr. Beast again in a 2018 yeah, video. Because the differentiator for YouTube is how it pays its creators. YouTube brings in a bunch of ads and gives half of that revenue to the uploaders. Yeah, can you whip up the YouTube numbers from last year? Last quarter, YouTube made over $7 billion in ads for their parent company, Alphabet. Okay, ipso facto, that means YouTube paid an equal amount. $7 billion. To the people, the creators who uploaded videos. That's $28 billion a year in YouTube revenues for creators. Okay, now Jack, can we sprinkle on the context here? That's the same revenue that Netflix makes. YouTube is paying its creators the same amount of money that Netflix brings in. That's why YouTube's thumbnail code is a code worth cracking. Thanks for jumping in T-Boy style. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more pop biz that you need.